Hey guys and welcome. Um, another tune to we are once again on Calvis Ravine or however the map is called. Um, it's quite late here, but still I'm <coughs> commentating this game. <laughs> it, uh, I just played it uh, together with a guy called Dude, and we were uh, playing a couple of tune twos. So um, I am starting here at the bottom right corner <coughs> as the um, purple um, Terran. So. Um, my uh, ally here, dude, he uh, was also playing Terran, light blue, at the um, bottom left corner. At, to, at the top left corner, our opponent number one was the um, red Protoss, and opponent number two, his ally, was the um, blue Zerg in the top right corner. <coughs> so, um, yeah, well, we will see how this game develops. I can um, definitely say there were some. <laughs> some, uh, you know, like huge um, walking uh, guys around. Um, I don't want to actually call them by name right now, but I maybe, maybe you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> um, okay, so anyway, um, the, the um, red Protoss is getting up a pylon and a gateway. <coughs> Let's see, the blue Zerg is getting an extremely quick gas, I think. He doesn't even have a spawning pool or an expansion. He's getting gas and now getting a spawning pool. Um, by the way, me and my ally, or my ally and me, is um, better, I think. We decided to try to, um, well, bl <laughs> like block the Zerg on his on his choke and build some uh, bunkers there. So. Um, Let's see. Uh, I think yeah. Here, here is my um, SCV going out, and um, I think I'm kind of lucky that his Overlord. I mean, he sees the SCV, but not building me up that bunker in a second. Uh, I'm scouting here. See, he has the gas. I don't know even if I saw the pool. I was just checking if he has any sunken or whatever. Um, okay, so here's the bunker. And I also set the rally point here in a second. There we go. Rally point set here. Bunker is ready in a second. First two marines on their way. Let's see here. Yeah. There you go, guys. There you go. Oh, nice banner here. Check this out. Cool. Yeah, well, anyway. Um. So, Protoss is pumping out of one uh, gateway. Didn't went double gate, so he most probably doesn't have enough to um, intercept here, um, intercept our our bunker rush, more or less. Well, it's actually not a rush, we just wanted to we are <laughs> both still noobs, so uh, we should have put the bunker somewhere over there, most probably, here, there. But uh, we didn't. <laughs> we built those bunkers here. And my ally um, puts one in front of me. So um, let's see. In the meanwhile, he's building a tech lab. So he's able to research. First of all, he's able to build marauders and reapers or ghosts. No, ghosts, you need more for that. Um, a ghost academy, yeah, makes sense. <laughs> um, anyways, yeah, he can also upgrade that stuff, although I think it's a bit early for that. Um, but he has two uh, barracks, also double gas. What do I have here? Also two barracks. I have no additional building because I was more thinking about switching to a uh, mag. Um, double gas for me as well. And here he now he sees it, and you can see he um, he's building banelings and. Actually, I tried to hold the defense with Protoss versus those Banelings once, and let's see here, I am I decided to unload my Marines and not only sit there and wait, but um, to... Uh, yeah, that was pretty weird here. I was sending in one Marine and I hoped all three would attack this one, but he was just putting them on hold. Now one is incoming and backing off once again. So he already has a lair because he got the gas so uh, early. <coughs> um, and yeah, the Banelings are pretty, 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 um, pretty strong versus uh, infantry. They can just burn like, I don't know, whole um, squads of marines into ashes, into green acid stuff. Um, 
let's see. Yeah, I was constantly trying to lure him into those, into our bunkers, make him kind of panic and then just go like, okay, now I attack. But um, oh, he actually kept kind of cool, only trying to attack me on the creep where his um, zerglings are so fast. I think he has the speed upgrade. Yeah, he has the speed upgrade for the zerglings. And the bailings can also get uh, upgraded and they uh, start rolling and they are pretty fast. And as I said before, I once tried to hold the defense with Protoss and I had a lot of units there. As well as a gateway in, in the way blocking the choke kinder. And he, uh, the Zerg once then attacked uh, with these... Uh, wow, check this animation out here, pretty cool. Um, yeah, anyways, he attacked with... Um, with uh, the the bane links and he was able to crush half of my forces as well as the gateway <clears throat> so they are definitely pretty strong um, yeah more versus light units I think not versus armored but um, yeah versus light units especially the they will just wow melt them like nothing that's pretty pretty hard you really have to micro and focus also pretty nice for team A I think and you can see the Zerg is now starting to attack the rocks here so he knows he's kind of um, blocked, so what can he do? Well, that's pretty clever, killing the rocks and then most probably getting an expansion ready over there. Mm, let's see, what else is he doing? Oh, and here my ally tried to set up another a second bunker, but those speed uh, zerglings were able to uh, yeah, avoid that and killing all the forces. <coughs> I was trying to lure them away once again, but no way. Um, Blue was at least too good for that. So he didn't fall for that. Oh wow, and he researched Burrow, I think. So he can now um, Burrow those bailings, and I think um, you can not only um, kind of let them explode when they get in contact, so to speak, with a <laughs> with an uh, opponent unit, but you can also Burrow them, or just um, press a key and then boom, they explode like a um, like a mine. You wait there until forces are over you, and then boom, and Let's see. Yeah, he a creep tumor and um, zerglings take quite some time for those rocks. Whereas, for example, uh, immortals of the Protoss, they just eat those rocks like nothing. Um, <coughs> wow, infestation pit already done, and he's directly tacking into a hive uh, tier 3, I think. Uh, has an infest already, already. Um, yeah, well, pretty interesting. Let's see. Yeah, it looks cool, that's for sure. There you go. Pretty much looks like the brain bug from uh, Starship Troopers, but um, no problem. Okay, let's see, uh, the Red Protoss is now expanding. He uh, didn't even think about helping his ally here. Our bunkers are still there. And he's uh, just um, more or less pumping out, but only two gateways, actually warp gates now. So, um... Yeah, well, two cannons over there, so I don't know, he might have been afraid of a medivac drop. Um, and here my ally ex is expanding. expanding. Um, that's also pretty pretty cool, I think. Um, British people would say, like, expand, and um, Americans will say, like, uh, expand, I think. I don't know, actually. I'm not a native speaker, so I have no idea. But I know that... Um, Americans will say like um, uh, the other die, uh, the other day, and British people might say something like the other the other die, and um, so that is quite like I like that actually, like the other die, playing snooker, you know, snooker, pool, billiard. Uh, anyway. Um, so, and my ally now has uh, a couple of marauders and marines. Oh, our bunkers got crushed. I unfortunately missed that because I was here, okay, talking about uh, the English language. Anyway, so uh, that wasn't uh, such a big problem for them. I was repairing my bunker, but still, um, there was uh, links. Let's see, do they have any upgrades? I don't, I don't know. Nope, no crack links. Only speed links, but were a couple of them. Let's see what my ally is doing now. <clears throat> I totally cannot remember that. Looks like he's only waiting. And here, what did I build in the meantime? These are those heavy walking um, rhinos I was talking about. Thors. 
um, three ready uh, as well as a couple of marines and I also took my expansion over there I killed the rocks um, yeah get the, uh, the additional gas two factories also I'm getting the plus one at attack upgrade for Mac um, ground in a minute <coughs> and oh and here is the infester I don't know he could have my control one of my Thors I think using fungal growth though on these um, marauders and you can see they are they cannot move for us uh, for a second uh, for a couple of seconds and they are getting damaged like I don't know 30 30 whatever health points are being reduced